Husqvarna have come in, they're going to start setting up some mowers today, tomorrow. So that's going to be interesting to see how they're going to help us. I mean, it was good to have a good sponsor on board. I was skeptical a little bit about some of the mowers that you just wanted to put out here. A little bit fear of the unknown, and I thought what we, was do what we did worked quite well before that. So after the competition, we tested them a little bit more. When he saw the results, after a while, he was very, very happy about it. So after that, he was very interested to do more with his corner and bring more robots on the course. You can't argue with like how clean it keeps it. So we get lots of rain and the fertilizer's kicking in and every time we cut we have to blow rough after it and it takes ages to do everything. Like now this thing, you don't have to do that. If you asked me before the competition, I couldn't see myself having them after you guys packed up and left, but they did a better job than I thought. So yeah, we leased them and they're still going here now. They're cutting all the time and uh, they don't have any grass leftovers, so it's always clean around the, the clubhouse and, the, and the, in the roughs that we are using the robots. And uh, they are quiet and uh, protect the environment. The way things are with the environment and so much uh, focus on that, we thought it's a good to start going down that line as well. And they are working all day and night, so we save a little bit of hours so our greenkeepers can do other important things. So even with our course manners, is that we're going to have more of those larger ones. The future is to, to uh, bring robots to the golf courses. Like at the moment, we have still got all of our machinery. Maybe it's a choice down the line if we downsize in one of those machines and upsize in the robotic sort of area. Other course managers asking me and Craig how, about, how they are working. Our answer is that uh, try it because it's very good.